Greetings and welcome. My name is Aaron Craig with Let's Learn This Together. Stick around to the end of the video to hear about the details of my giveaway that I'm doing on every Game Maker video. And what I want to talk about is just how this series or playlist for making a beautiful inventory in Game Maker is going to work and how it's going to come out and what my hope for it is. So if you're really eager and you don't care about this, Go ahead and skip, I won't have my feelings hurt. But what I wanted to do with this inventory and with this project was to make it as accessible to as many games as possible. When you start getting into more advanced tutorials, it becomes really hard to actually apply it to your specific game. So I really went out of my way to try and break this up into searchable chunks. So that's why these videos are coming out as individuals. And at the end, it'll come out as one long video if you prefer to watch it that way. But my goal is to have each of these videos be searchable for one specific topic, like how to add an item to a DS grid or how to limit the inventory size of your inventory, the size of your inventory. Each of those subjects are individual videos because sometimes that's just what people need to see. So that's how they're going to come out. And if you don't have the patience to wait for all of the videos, then check out my Patreon where you can get early access and support me for as little as a dollar a month. So how this series is gonna break down is like this. We're first gonna have a discussion about the core concepts of an inventory. That's gonna come up next. And I'm really excited because I think it's a really great discussion and I really want to hear your feedback. Then we're going to start working on building the inventory one thing at a time. We're going to build the base code for an inventory using a DS grid. Then we're going to be able to add items to it with one script or one function that you can then use anywhere in your game. And then we're going to start displaying that master inventory list. We're going to figure out how to do drag and drop inventories. We're going to figure out how to use sequences to bring up a beautiful transition for a description of an item. I'm going to show you how to lock down the size of your inventory so that you can increase it or decrease it as you want. We're going to go over how to give every object, every NPC or player in your game a unique inventory so that you're not just using one because that's really boring and not very useful. And then we're going to go over how to sort an inventory by different properties. That one's going to be fairly complex complex, but it's also going to be really useful, especially if you have any interest in data structures or algorithms, then we're going to be talking about that in that video a little bit to give you a good idea of how sorting works and the trade-offs that you have to take depending on the approach that you take. Yeah, that makes sense, right? And then finally, we're just going to wrap it all up, put a bow on top of it, fix any small problems that we might have, and call it good. And then you'll be able to use this system wherever you want change the GUI, change the sprites, just modify where you draw things at, and you'll be able to use it in any project in Game Maker that you want. So I hope that's really helpful. I hope you're excited because I've spent a lot of time on this and I think it's turned out really, really well. So give me your feedback, let me know what you think, and that's all I wanted to talk about. So thank you for joining me. Now the details on the giveaway are simple. You just have to like this video and leave a comment. Show me that your keyboard is working, and then a week after the video is posted, I will draw a name and reach out to you if you win. You'll get a coupon for my beginner's course, which you can use for yourself give to a friend, or use as a discount on one of my more expensive courses. So let me know that your keyboard works by just leaving a comment and you'll be entered to win. Thank you so much for joining me. And as I always say, keep making, keep learning, and I'll talk to you later. A huge thank you to all of the awesome people who support me over on Patreon. Their names are on the screen now, and every dollar pledged helps me create more awesome content. You can support me for as little as $1 a month and get access to exclusive perks like my Discord server, your name in the credits, early access to my YouTube videos and courses, and more. Check it out at patreon.com slash letslearnthistogether.com or find the link in the description below and become a patron today.